this? Did we kill him? Did I do that? When I started the game today, it said it said that I last played this 40 days ago. So <laughs> we haven't we haven't played this in a while. Um but that's okay. We'll figure it out. All right, let's let's look at the let's look at the journal. So we're we're doing this. We're doing this, okay? So we came we came here, yeah. We came here to see why the colony was attacked. Okay. The leader may have information you need. Go to the stairs. Free, okay, right. Okay, I remember this. I remember this. They've taken control of a tower. Go up the stairs. We killed a bunch of of Geth. Um. Take the elevator. Use a vehicle to make your way. I remember driving and shooting stuff. Do you guys remember that? You've detected a mysterious signal that seems to be coming from a different group of colonists. You think it's worth your time? Track down these colonists before heading to the Exogeny headquarters. Can we? So we did that. You take the Geth force field down in order to warn the Normandy. Right, right. We walked into the room and there was like the force field and there were two Geth that were working on it and then we murdered them. So we did. We did that. Okay. The claws are too large to disable with conventional weapons. Find the ship's priming claw and figure out a way to destroy it. Okay, we did that. You have we destroyed the ship. Now get Lisbeth and leave. And then we came and we found her mom. Juliana. At the refugee camp. Yes. Okay. 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 I it's it's coming back to me now. It's coming back to me. I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. Uh, I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Go on. I'm listening. Good, good. Poking around in the ruins has become a bit too dangerous for me. Why do people always assume we enjoy putting ourselves in harm's way? It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. You're awfully quick to trust me with this. Have you seen anyone else heading to Exogeny lately? I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Do we of trust course, him? This all depends on getting out of here alive. Should we should we kill him? Why work in the middle of nowhere if your skills are so useful? Maybe I've got a bit of the frontier spirit in me. That and the alternative is a bit too secure for my liking. Freelancers don't have to worry about security as much, so long as we keep a low profile. Um, time to get moving. Please try to avoid hurting the colonists. Use the nerve agent I gave you if you can. Fuck. Okay, we gotta not hurt people. Equip the anti thorium gas upgrade to your grenades. I think I, I think I did that. I think I did that before I finished last time. Um, so that I wouldn't accidentally kill people. anti throwing gas. Okay. Yes. Okay. 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 We're gonna not kill people. We're gonna kill people. That doesn't sound like me. I know, I was thinking ahead. I'm a goddamn pro. Oh, okay. This is good. This is good. This is good. Maybe. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. Very well, Command. Let's go. Do you guys? Oh shit! You can't see that, but it's it says um, sixteen colonists alive. Where are my boys? Boys with me? Come on, Garrus. Don't get stuck in the door. Coming in? Okay. You don't like grenades this game? No! No, I don't, uh... Oh, loading. I don't fully understand how they work. 
This game has grenades? Yes, every time I use one, I am surprised. I remember the the um, the controls being like uh, kind of annoying, where they're all like all the all the boxes are super sticky. Hi, Dylan. Welcome. How much press the button was to throw them twice? Oh shit! Is that is that how it works? <laughs> like you you can actually you could you could do that. <laughs> You hit it again? You don't throw two grenades? Damn. Water valve. Why do I want to open this? This valve looks like part of a large system. There are likely others we need to activate okay. as well. Okay. That's how that's you have to do it. I knew that. Yeah, I knew that. I just wanted to make sure that you knew that, you know? Music's kind of fun, though. Garrett. 
Garrus? Is Garrus dead? <laughs> Where the fuck is Garrus? Is this how I bring them back? I'm better now. Get your ass back here, dude! Oh, he was right there. He was at my feet. He died. He's okay now. I brought him back. I'm standing on his corpse. Yeah. <laughs> Standing on his corpse. He's okay. He's okay. He came back. He's got like half health. No problem. That's not a door. Why would that be a door? He's okay. Yeah. He's never felt better actually. Alright. We're gonna go, we're gonna go back and uh, make sure there's nothing back here. We're gonna go back and we're gonna try to go in that elevator and see if that takes us anywhere. So I'm wondering if it's it's still just there. Oh, there we go. It doesn't look like it's on yet. We should keep looking. Okay, 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 okay. We got two of those. We've got two of those, guys. Two water valves. Maybe there's another one somewhere. The music? Do you like it? Hello? How's it going? You cur- Message meant to go here. This is awkward. 263 items. 300 item limit. Or salvage any new items you find when you the zone. Okay. Okay, you guys have to help me. Oh, son of a bitch! Who did that? that killed me last time. Sludge canister. Got a new got a new shotgun. This old save vehicle was more willing to part with the still functioning power cell. Okay, 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 alright. So we're gonna take all of that. Okay! So we found um we found two Two water valves, a bunch of items, all the colonists are still alive. Uh, collapsed bridge. So that's nice. It's gonna warn me every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think so. It does, it does appear that way, yes. Wait, 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 where the fuck am I? through 
here? We want to go over here. We want to go over here. Guys. This is this is where this is where we need the grenades, yeah, so we don't kill all the colonists. They have names, yeah. Biotics? I could just kill them though. I want to I I want to make more, but I don't know I don't know that I can, can I? I don't think I can. You think I just killed them? No no, they're all still alive. Sixteen. 
16 are still alive. Alright, this guy- well, this guy- okay, you have to die. Sorry. 15. 15 are alive. <laughs> 15. Okay, we got- we got more, um... We got more. We got more, guys. We got more. Hi, Vez! One guy- one guy had to be sacrificed. There was nothing I could do. No more grenades. I have no more grenades. Oh? I tried to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trusted me. It wants me to. Stop you, but I won't. I won't. That makes my job easier. Guys, we only killed one colonist. That's pretty good, yeah. bad or maybe we can go down here oh <laughs> yeah this is probably where the exclamation points are don't forget to save We only killed we only killed one guy. And that was because I didn't have any grenades. Otherwise I totally would have not murdered him. Right? Alright, we just need to find this creature and determine what it what it is. This was not covered by my training. He's big. We are gonna need bigger guns. What the fuck is that? What is that? A little, uh... Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. 
I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren, something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh barely given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. Give me what I need and I'll strike back at the one who betrayed you. No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short. Uh oh. But have gone on too long. Hi, Tom. Your ah! will fuck the ground in the new growth. Running in circles. Can I, uh. Negotiate, yeah, or threaten. <laughs> we can, maybe we can threaten them some more. You know, be like, hey, I'll stop killing you if you uh, give me what I want. Nothing wrong.
Oh, he's dead. Hi, Steve. How's your day going? I like the shotgun. We need a Garrus death count. We do. We do. Yeah, he's just, he's constantly dying. Is that, like, does he need better armor, or it, does he just have, like, no health? Can we name my shotgun the negotiator? Yeah. Yeah, we definitely can. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? What was I thinking? What was I what was I feeling? <laughs> um What the fuck was my thought process there? Don't know. Yeah, me neither. weapons. They are using the wrong weapons. Okay, so Rex is supposed to be using a shotgun and Garrus is supposed to be using an assault rifle. Why did they switch? Did I switch them accidentally when I was switching my weapon? Switch during cinematics. Garbage. Hey. Can you? Why can't I save here? Because there's bad guys. Still can't quick save. Alright. No saving. No saving.
Garrus is dead. Surprise. But it's going to assume um, that he's always dead. Yeah. He just he's just constantly constantly dead. Do you remember what we're doing in this game? I like I like kinda do. It's coming back to me now. Holy shit, that one's fucking strong! I should thank you for releasing me. Who is this? Who are you? How did you end up inside that thing? My name is Shiala. I serve... I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Venezia lost her way. What do you... Uh, what do you mean? Are you saying Saren can control minds? Venezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. She tried to manipulate Saren, but in the end, her plan backfired. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel, an enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is mm. absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. They were allies? Then why were the Geth trying to destroy the Thorian? After Saren had what he needed, the Thorian became a liability. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What does it do? What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. Yeah. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. You must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. It's knowledge? So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. 
a viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. So can we just like take her brain? It's like reading the Elder Scrolls. <laughs> what, if we, what if we just kill her? And take her brain and somehow fuse it with ours. You know? There has to be a way. I need that knowledge to stop Saren. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours. By cutting your brain open, right? Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Guys, I don't know. Must touch another mind. This seems really sketchy. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe. Oh, this seems so sketchy. Embrace eternity. given you the cipher just as it was given to Saren the ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you are you all right? Holy shit. what just happened thank you thank you thank you thank you I'm okay I'm okay I saw something I'm okay it still didn't make any sense you have been given a great gift the experience of an entire people it will take time for your mind to process this information that's fair we should get you back to the ship commander Medical needs to know about this. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. What were you saying? Do you know what the conduit is, or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the Prothean extinction. That can't be good, whatever it is. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it before Saren does. Is there anything else you can tell me about the Thorian? When the creature enveloped me, I became part of it. But I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. <laughs> it transcended all classification. <laughs> and now it is gone. <laughs> I don't know why I find that line funny. Its mind was awesome. Um, don't tell me you feel sorry for that thing. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I'm grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. Is it the same as the two year though? What else can you tell me about Saren? <laughs> there is little I could tell maybe, you that maybe the IOU's only three. He's powerful, he's charismatic, and he is dangerous. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature. But now I see he's leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. What a, what a, what the fuck are you going to do now? Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. Sounds good. The colonists will need all the help they can get. 
They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. Oh. You did it. With the Thorian gone, we can start rebuilding for ourselves again. And we're free of Exogeny's threats. We're back to being just a little nowhere colony. Thank you, Commander. You're welcome. It'll be tough going, but we'll make this a home. You saved most of the infected. It'll take time to recover from the physical Mouse. effects, but they'll be all right. <laughs> Thank you. We can we killed we killed what we killed one guy. We killed one guy and that wasn't my fault. Okay? Couldn't I couldn't help it. You know? Just happened. I never thought I would be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined, filtered. What will you do now that the fighting is over? I may stay, try to recover my losses. I can have new supplies delivered within weeks. Perhaps the colony will survive after all. Goodbye. Bye. I wish you well in your future efforts. See ya. It, it doesn't hurt anymore. I can think my own thoughts again. We have a chance to start over, thanks to you. You're welcome. Food is still our immediate concern, but we'll manage. I killed a thing. I took out what looked like the <laughs> oldest of the Varen. The rest are yours. That's great. I killed the thing. I mean, Varen tastes horrible, but with the Geth gone, I can organize a hunt. Thank you for not abandoning us like everyone else. No problem. I should go. Here, for your trouble. It's not much, I know, but it's all we can spare. What did he give me? Job. He gave me like 20 grand. That's enough? For killing like one monster? I can think without pain. Thank you. You're welcome. You've given us a second chance. It's nice to have more mundane worries, like getting that water flowing again. The water's back on again. Really? I'll need to get the relays going then. Here's a small You're welcome. Finally, that damn thing is out of my head. I can think without pain. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? Chat, we, we did all the side quests before we had the yeah. side quests. My dad gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. <laughs> now, now we're just, now now we're just turning them in. Only up and running in no That's kind of nice. Look at that. All right. Classic. Yeah, we had everything we needed. Look, all done. No problem. All right. So now we now now we just leave. Now we just leave, guys. playing this game okay and you got to the point where it's like you saved most of the colonists yeah you had you had to shoot one okay you had to shoot one but you did save most of them which is nice um and then and then you get to the point where you're like all right I'm good here. I should go back to the ship. How would you do that? If you were in this situation. <laughs> How might one do that? Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's a good question, right? I thought so. Yeah, I thought so. 
Good question. Next question. Cause like we were we were stuck here, right? Weren't we stuck here for a while? Like we couldn't. Um, Rex, what are you doing? Who are you hiding from? This place is better days. Why are you crouched around the corner? It's okay, buddy. These are friends. These are our friends. He's a, he's inspecting. He's doing a pretty good job. Yeah, he's pretty. He's, do, he's doing a pretty good job. Like you know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pretend I don't know that's my ship. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm, I've just I've been I've been testing you guys today, right? We've had a lot of pop quizzes about the game and controls and how everything works. And it's all it's all for your benefit, right? Cuz I know. I know the answers to all the questions I'm asking. <laughs> I just want to make sure that you guys know. You know? You know, guys? You learn something today? See? That's why I do it. I just want people to learn. Guys, we did it. We made it back to the ship. Look at that. Easy. Stand by, shore party. Is there gonna be a quiz? Oh, there's always Commander, a quiz. You look pale. Are you suffering any ill effects from the cipher? Oh shit! We look fucking terrible. Uh, I feel strange. The cipher shook me up a bit. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we can make some sense of it. Do we want even more people probing around in our brain? Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. That was incredible. All this time, all my research, yet I... I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so... intense. You are remarkably strong-willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Did you see anything? The beacon on Shut Eden up, Prime must have been badly damaged. Large parts of the vision are... are missing. The data transferred into the commander's mind is incomplete. Did you learn anything? You must have seen something. I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision. What was there, at least. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can... I can... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. Are you okay? Dr. Chakwash should take a look at you. That will not be necessary. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. We're done here. Dismissed. That was a bit harsh. The way that I said that. I sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Ugh. Do we want to... <laughs> Do we want to talk to the council? <laughs> to answer his problem for his salad, yeah. <laughs> sure. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander, Exogenia should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. Exogeny tried to study it. Look how that turned out. Perhaps it's for the best, then. At least the colony was saved. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help a human colony. That's true. I only killed one guy. Being human had nothing to do with it. They were in trouble. Only one and dude. 
But sometimes specters have to make sacrifices. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. Goodbye, Commander. We will be waiting for your next report. Bye. Let's go find our boys. Commander, I... What can I do for you? What's going on, dude? Something bothering you? It's Saren. I'm starting to wonder whether we'll ever find him. He's always one step ahead of us, and he's got those damn geth. We're getting close, Garrus. We'll find him. I wish I had your confidence. I just can't stand the thought of him getting away with everything he's okay. done. I know you're doing everything you can, and if anyone can catch him, it's you, but if there's anything else I can do to help, anything, just tell me what you want me to do, and I'll do it. I understand your concern, but we will anything find Anything, guys? Just make sure you're ready to go when we do. Yes, ma'am. You can count on me. Thanks for hearing me out. I appreciate it. Can I ask you something, Commander? Of course. What is it? Are you worried that the Council might be protecting Saren? I mean, they were really dragging their heels before. What if we find him, bring him back to the Citadel, and they refuse to act? I get the feeling this isn't a question. Speak your mind, Garrus. Well, maybe we shouldn't give them the chance, Commander. Oh. In my opinion, Saren's too dangerous to be kept alive. Too much could happen. He could escape, or the Council might let him go. If we find him, when we find him, I say we make sure we stop him permanently. I really want him to like me. <laughs> so we're, go we're gonna agree with him. Yeah, agreed. I'm glad you see it that way. I never had any intention of capturing that bastard. Not ours. When yep. I see him, he dies. Good. The council won't like it, but they can't stop you either. You see, this is why I want to be a specter. You never have to worry about bureaucratic idiots making a mess of everything. Just make sure you're ready when it happens. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Hey, Rex. What's up, dude? What do you want, Shepard? Are your people really dying? We're sure not getting any stronger. We're too spread out. None of us are interested in staying in our own system. Lots of species have left their homes and prospered. But they go to colonize new worlds. We're not settlers. We're warriors. We want to fight. So we leave. Hire ourselves out. And most of us never go back. So long, Rex. Shepard. I want... I want... I want Garrus to like me. Head to the Amazon system in the Voyager cluster and investigate. Right, let's do that. Voyager, Amazon. Commander, incoming signal. I haven't played it. HQ on the Citadel. Commander Shepard, something uncomfortable has just come up. In the first contact war, we fired a lot of espionage probes into Turian space. We just received a mission complete burst from one of them. Where's it been in the meantime? No idea. Lost in transit. These probes were built in a hurry after first contact. What makes this uncomfortable? When these probes were launched, we didn't have any idea who we were fighting. We didn't want to risk aliens examining our technology. The probe has a demo nuke built in. A 20 kiloton tactical fusion warhead. About equal to the bomb dropped on Hiroshima back in the 20th. If somebody finds that probe, tampers with it. You don't need me to finish, Commander. I understand this must be handled, but I don't have anyone trained to deal with this sort of thing, sir. I know. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. These probes have been classified for 26 years. The Council will call fusion bomb booby traps dangerous and irresponsible. The Alliance would face censure if they find this probe. I'm asking you because the Normandy can get on site quickly and quietly. It's in the Voyager cluster. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. <sighs> we'll get on it immediately, Admiral. And we'll be discreet. I appreciate that, Commander. Good luck. To fleet out.
Where, where the, where is, where is it? Hopefully not. Space boys. percent agreed how do I mine shaft that's the source of the signal this smells I agree your probe didn't crash it was moved here they may not know what they have let's find it before they set it off right we're going in the mine and they called it kill in here? Any friends? Anybody at all? Why did I scream? I scared myself by opening the menu. <laughs> very normal things. Very, very normal things. One bomb. Oh, son of a bitch. That was a detonator. Someone just screwed us. <laughs> Shepard, at last. <laughs> I didn't see anything. Who are you? You have me at a disadvantage. My name is Ilanos Heliot. I doubt you know it. Who do you think runs the Terminus clan, Shepard, huh? I don't know. Thousands of pirates, slavers, criminals of every stripe? I don't study the internal politics of pirate bands. The strongest... <laughs> the one who that was the almost as loud as this. the most ships, pillages the most colonies. <laughs> Three years ago, I bit. was the strongest. I <laughs> used my influence you. to assemble a fleet. We would drive your kind out of the verge. <laughs> You're the one behind the attack on Elysium. I was the motivator, the instigator, the one who promised glory and riches for sacking the largest human colony in the cluster. The one blamed when it failed. Failed! I was ruined when your kind held against the Blitz. What better way to recover my reputation than by eliminating the first human specter? Um... Call the Normandy. It doesn't have to be like this, Halliot. Empty words from a dead woman. Hey, with her. Goodbye, Shepard. Orders, Commander. Nobody panic. Should we kill her? I don't know. Let me think. You two, see if there's anything in here we can use. We should probably kill him. There's no time to get out. You have to disable the bomb before it goes off. Am I 
my god. help did you guys see there were three points and there's three of us and I did all of them and you just stood here not helping disappointed are you boys stuck together I conjugate. This is the second stream. But first, first stream back to um, Mass Effect. <laughs> They're wiggling. <laughs> I call them useless. And now they're striking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they're having a good time. I want to join them. Look at them. They're just dancing. They're stuck. I don't have a vehicle. It looks like it's down here. Down here for some reason? Dude, where's my car? Am I gonna die? No, this is fine. This is fine. I don't know if those are bad guys. Are you good guys or bad guys? Oh! They're pirates! Could I? Could I have negotiated? Hi, James. How's your day going? I wonder if I could have negotiated. Oh, right here. It's a corpse. I probably drove over it. Got it. Easy. Hi, Austin. Okay, who am I gonna romance? For you is Ashley? Who is Ashley? No. Garrus. Garrus is my boy. 100%. Alright, I think we're- I think we're good here. I think we're- oh my- oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. I think we're- I think we're good. Oh, we got it. Stretch our neck. Stretch your neck, guys. It's better than Mars. I I really like how uh, how red it is. Okay, all right. Let's do this. Located on the Bostock system of the Maroon Sea cluster. Bostock Maroon Sea. Let's go. Here. 
Looks like we've got an active distress beacon on the planet below, Commander. No message, just a locator signal. <gasps> it's so pretty! <gasps> oh. There's giant insects. Okay, we, we will go there. We will go there. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Aside from the giant bugs, it looks beautiful. So pretty. Oh, I like it here. It's gorgeous. Are those bugs? What are you? Can I pet you? Can I ride it? I want to ride it. Can I put a little saddle on it? A little saddle on it, space horses, yeah. With the little T Rex arms, that'd be fun. Do you know what I wish you could do? you could whistle for your vehicle you know how often when you play games and you have a horse or like a mount you can whistle for it and it comes running <laughs> I want to do that with my space rover I also want to be very careful that I don't kill these creatures because they're kind of cute how the fuck do I get over this One still alive. Where is it? Kaboom! I got him. <laughs> this is how you spend the majority of this game exploring planets. It's fun! Yeah! Yeah, the exploration is super fun. Let's go in here. Hello? I've come to save you from the space bugs. Maybe. Maybe you are space bugs. Are these the space bugs? Oh, creepers. For yelling but there was a dude coming right at us and you didn't seem to care hello creepers any more creepers in here
the the button the button for the map is wrong. The button for the map is wrong. No, you're not. You're crushed on the ground. No, Rex, not you. Fucking, <laughs> fucking space boys. Come on. <laughs> Just lead the way. God damn it. All right. Well, I guess they're hanging out there now. <laughs> Take a knee too, Mike. Rescuers? Who's in the garage? <laughs> See? I told you somebody would come to investigate that signal. My name is Dr. Ross, Chief Exogeny Researcher at this facility. We've been trapped in this room for days. We're almost out of food and water. You got here just in time. What happened? I need to know what's going on. Why is this place crawling with Thorian creepers? How do you know about the Thorian? I know what Exogeny was up to. I saw what they let the Thorian do to those colonists. So I destroyed it. Our secret's out then. No point in my lying. You already know the worst. The creepers here were created using altered samples from the specimens on Pharos. We discovered a way to turn them into docile, obedient servants. Everything was going fine until a few days ago. Then all the creepers suddenly went berserk. Only a handful of us made oh, it back into the safety I, of this room. Pro probably because I killed the big one. Any chance some of the other people at the base might still be alive? Hmm, I doubt it. Too many creepers out there. They never stood a chance. We're the only ones left. Why didn't you send a clear message asking for help? All we had was that signal from the emergency beacon. This is a closed communications base. Exogeny was worried about someone on the project selling secrets to a rival firm or reporting our work to the authorities. We have no direct communication with the outside. The music Only got the really creepy. Beacon. It sends a general distress signal to the Exogeny site on Pharos. They're supposed to send a team to respond inside of 24 hours, but it sounds like they had problems of their own. Any idea why they turned on you? Maybe there was still some kind of link between the Creepers and the Thorian back on Pharos. The Thorian was unlike any other life form we've ever studied. I can't explain how, but maybe I said. when it died, it, it somehow set off the Creepers here. Okay, so here's the thing. I don't trust her. So maybe... I've heard all I need to. We, just, we should Look, kill her. <laughs> I know what we did here was wrong. I'll admit that. But it's over now. You know? There's no sense reporting this to the authorities, right? People lost their lives. You were in charge of this project. The safety of the staff is your responsibility. Yeah. They trusted you and you betrayed that trust. Be reasonable. I didn't mean for this to happen. Besides, how does it help anyone if I end up in jail? I wasn't Normally, intending to end up back, in jail. I was going to murder you. It sounds like they're going to have their hands full cleaning up the mess on Pharos. But I've got money. A nice little emergency fund I set up. It's yours if you let us go. <gasps> Should we kill her? Oh. Okay. I'm hoping... No, Legend... Now, do you think if I choose I should kill you right now, I actually kill her? Or I'm just threatening her? As in, like, I should kill you right now. <laughs> Bitch. And then she'd be like, okay, I'll double the money. You know? Let's find out. <laughs> Try and see. 
<laughs> I'm not gonna say okay. I'm not gonna say okay. I can't do that. I should find out. I should kill her. I should kill you right now. This isn't about money. It's about justice. Blood for blood. Uh, that's not going to happen. Open fire. Oh, shit. Open fire. Jetpack, <laughs> 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 bitch. How do you guys feel about that? <laughs> That's not gonna happen! Boom! Dead. Probably shouldn't have killed her. I wanted to though. You yeah. know? Justice. Justice was served. <laughs> That's negotiation! <laughs> we did- we did name our shotgun the negotiator. Right? So, I mean, there's that. Garrus, do you still like me? I'm here if you need me. Okay, good. <laughs> as long as, as long as you're okay. okay. So we can, we can land here. This looks similar to the last place. Are there giant bugs here too? Pioneer team scattered across the surface. Okay. Tacos are not for doggos. Oh, I think you're wrong. I think most doggos would disagree. Civilian structure, science facility, civilian structure, anomaly, debris. All right, let's go. Let's go here first. God, these okay. These planets are beautiful, but holy fuck, they suck for exploring. <laughs> what the hell were they thinking? Yeah, dumplings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello? Definitely thinking Alberta. Yeah, like we like we have it in Ontario. It just it doesn't seem to be like overly popular. It's, it's definitely not everywhere. Hello? Anybody in here? 
You're not, you're not a fan? What don't you like about it? The sauce is too sweet. I'm kind, I'm kind of with you. I typically like sweet things, but usually if I'm eating something like that, like I, I crave savory. Shotgun to the face. Shwarma joins here on the on the west coast. Uh, yeah, I I prefer shawarma because of the garlic sauce. <laughs> Surprise chat! Shawarma is one of my favorite foods because of the garlic sauce. Let's go this way first. <laughs> Why is this room empty? Where's Rex? We lost him. He's still alive. Terminal. Alright, hold on. Oh, this one's tricky. Oh, chat, this one's very tricky. Because it hurts my brain. <laughs> it hurts my brain. There we go. Just, just garlic, chillas, yeah. You can just win me over with garlic. Fucking love garlic, man. None of them have survived. What to answer for? Download box. Okay. All right. Okay. 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 Balls. 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 I think there's still more to do on this planet. There was like another, another little facility. That we could go in and murder stuff. Definitely not a vampire, yeah. Yeah, would a vampire talk about garlic this much? I don't think so. So, I mean, clearly can't be a vampire. Rex, did you get stuck on that pole? Buddy. It's okay. Look, come this way. There you go. Come on. Yeah, you got it. Good job. All right. Heading out. Let's go, bitches. Uh, yeah, that sounds horrible. So what I hop a bit late, so this is a great marketing idea. That's how. Yeah, it sounds terrible. But it is gonna work. <laughs> if it's if it's a limited time thing, it will work from a marketing standpoint. Because people will be like, that's gross. We should buy it, and then we can all try it. <laughs> because that's the way people work. on your friend. Yeah. That's gross. Let's make an event out of it. We're gonna buy it and then next time we get together we're all gonna sit around and we're gonna eat them. You know? The 
There's one left. Where are you? Must be up top. I bet you can't eat more than one. <laughs> Just modify their... Yeah, modify... Oh, hello! Just modify their slogan. I found him. You know? He was right there, guys. Paint station. Okay. What else have we got here? What is this? All right, we have to we have to deal with our inventory, guys. We got we got so much stuff. <laughs> we are approaching. We are approaching the three hundred mark. What did that say? Two eighty two. Something like that. And then we picked up two or three more items. Ooh, what is this? More stuff. Cool. 288. We're at 288. Have a good night, Tanzir. Thanks for hanging out. Go get some rest. Sleep well. Alright, we're gonna go back. Wait, no, we're not. We're not done here. We haven't done this, right? We have not done this. Okay, hold on. Can't go back yet. was so difficult. Needs a pyramid. Why is there a pyramid here? Like that, yeah. Any space coyotes? No? No space coyotes. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> We're not gonna make it. Guys, we did it. We're on top of the mountain. Alright, okay. We did it. Just in the nick of time. That's, yeah, I like to live life on the edge. <laughs> Commander, I wanted to thank you. What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you, letting me be part of your team. I've learned a lot. I've thought about what you said, about eliminating the threat immediately, regardless of the cost. You were right. And you were right about Dr. Salia, too. Killing him was the only solution. This way, we'll know we'll never hurt anyone again. Words mean nothing until you turn them into action, Garrus. What are you gonna do about it? I'm going to reapply for Spectre training. It will probably kill my father, but I've got to try. If that doesn't work, I'll do just about anything, except go back to CSEC. I'm done with it. No more red tape, no more politics. From now on, I do things my way. I'm glad you see it that way. Keep that in mind when we meet Saren. Don't worry, Commander. I will. I what? I what? Commander, I wanted to thank you. I don't have time for this. No, I didn't. Okay. Oh. Goodbye, Commander. No, it was just we had that conversation already. Balls! Did I fuck that up? Oh fuck, Ashley! I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> Garrus, I'm sorry. Why does this say point of interest? They can't possibly mean Ashley. Can they? Commander? Do you have a few minutes to talk? One-on-one? -on -one? 
Sure. I, I was hoping to get a minute of your time off the record. Is this duty related, Chief? No, ma'am. Well, maybe. I, I know things are different aboard the Normandy, but uh, I'm I'm concerned about the aliens, Vicarian and Rex. With all due respect, Commander, should they have full access to the ship? Don't mince words, Chief. What's your concern? This is the most advanced ship in the Alliance Navy. I don't think we should give them free reign to poke around the vital systems. Engines, sensors, weapons. You're out of line. That's enough, Chief. You always second guess your superiors. Ma'am, no ma'am. Fuck you, I'm sorry, Ashley. I was out of line. I'll get back to my duties, Commander. She's hating on my space bros. No, Garrus, Garrus is, um, Garrus is everything. Well, I guess, I guess maybe we, uh, race against time. Find the conduit, explore Pharaoh's Neveria. Let me find clues. All right, I guess we're doing this. Yeah. Pass back to me. Good, good. It took me, it took me a little bit to get back into it. I couldn't quite remember what the fuck we were doing. Um, but I'm like, I'm fully back in now. Fully back in. Commander, I'm reading a signal. Must be our celerity. Check out those defense towers. Drop the Mako. We'll go in <gasps> hot and take him out. I'll get you in it's underneath like, uh, the radar, Commander. Vacation here. You got a clean drop, Commander. What nobody say? Stay out of range and continue evasive maneuvers until I bring those AA towers down. I know the drill. Meet you at the camp once those towers are offline. Joke around. The music's fun. Are those... Those aren't bad guys. What are the things that it wants me to kill? These are just like little crabs.
My, uh... Like, mini-map is jammed. So I can't... I can't see anybody. Should we explore the gatehouse? Let's explore the gatehouse. Let's see, let's see if there's anything else. We need more loot. We just sold all of our loot. So now we now we need more to replace it. Right? Ah! 200 things we're still we're still getting the um the warning though. Oh no. Easy. That wasn't hard. What the fuck, game? Alright. We got that. Let's go. Always be looting. Yeah. <laughs> Always. Can we go this way? No. I wish I could jump. So that I could jump over the ledge. Save like three seconds. You know? break my ankle in the process. Like a handspring? Maybe I'm a gymnast. I don't know. Maybe before we became a specter, we uh, were a world class gymnasts. Follow me? It did not. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Let me go up, guys. Hello? Hello?
we got everybody. Activate. Disable. I'm reading that the grid is down, Commander. On approach to the Solarian base now. Out. Ready to continue. On your mark, Commander Shepard. Okay, it's ready. Most enemies don't have a weak point. Headshots, though, right? Boom, headshot. Right? That's like every game. So I just, I just assumed they also they remind me kind of of enemies from like Zelda. You know, you have to like shoot them in the eye. So I'm always just kind of like, yeah, that's like, what is it? look at that big giant thing. Turn based one would play well on the Switch. Yeah, yeah, I thought I thought that it might. Has anybody in chat? Well probably, but who who's played the, the original Final Fantasy? Not like the remakes that they're doing. But like the uh, the original one. Which one? Sorry, seven. Yeah, yeah, seven. Final well, Fantasy seven. You played it. Um, how how long is it? Like approximately. I know it's gonna like depend. But for like a pretty like pretty thorough but like casual first playthrough, off stream. What am I looking at? Like 40 hours? Longer? 50 ish? If you're powering through 50, 50 to 60. Like, I'll probably try to do like as, as many things as I can, but I'm also like not gonna be like obsessive about it. You know? Oh my god, this one's hard. Casual's like 30, 30 to 40. That's it. Nothing between us and the Solarian camp now. <laughs> Somewhere between 30 and 140. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> 60 sounds alright, Jazzer, with side stuff. Yeah, I was I was figuring it would probably be around 50, like 40 to 50, maybe a bit longer. But they split it. They're doing like a trilogy, right? So like the one that's out now, like that's not that's not the rest of the game. There's still there's still one more. Main plus extras average is 51. Commander, Normandy's touched down at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mike, yeah. <laughs> the good thing is though, well not the good thing, baby, but depending on who you are. I'm not I'm not gonna stream it, but I I probably do still get really distracted. So what are we supposed to do now? Oh, I was Stay talking about the original we can come up with a plan. Who the fuck is that? 
Who's standing beside me? Is that Caden? Who is that? Caden? Yeah? Why is he here? Who invited him? Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. Oh, that's just great. What now? We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. What? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what I have you like found? Him. Zarin's base of operations. He set up a research facility here, but it's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. Is he here? Have you seen him? No, but his Geth are everywhere and we've intercepted some comms referring to Saren. This is his facility, there's no doubt about that. What's he doing? What's Saren researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the genophage. What's so important about curing this genophage? It was the solution to the Krogan problem. We introduced the genophage to the Krogan population after the uprising to quell their numbers. Without the it, the Krogan the will quickly is, overrun the galaxy. Um, and these Krogan follow Saren. Wonderful. Uh... The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army... He'd be almost unstoppable. Unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Oh shit! Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. It's okay. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? Yep. Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. He's Rentola. in one of the tents nearby. Okay, thank you. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. Why are Kate so and Ashley here? Rex. It looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. <laughs> you think I should go talk to him? It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might actually. Just do it carefully. I'm not scared of him. Rex doesn't worry me. He'll fall in line. If you say so. But I'm gonna keep my eye on him, if it's all the same to you. I really, I really wanna slap her. Like right across her stupid face talking shit about my boy this isn't right Shepard if there's a cure for the genophage we can't destroy it calm down Rex I'm not the enemy here Saren's the one you should be mad at really Saren created a cure for my people you want to destroy it help me out here Shepard the lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand I shouldn't have to explain that to you Rex Indulge me. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. I don't like any of these options. Don't make me choose. What do you want from me? This isn't up for debate. I don't want to, like, I want to save him. Why can't I save him? Every option is basically a fuck you to Rex. I missed the option earlier in the combo. Balls. I can't let you jeopardize the mission. So that's it. All this time and that's all I get from you. How can you not see what this means to the Krogan? This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it.
I fucked up, chat! Should I tell him to calm down? That's a bad idea. <laughs> I feel like telling him to calm down is a bad idea. Um, I'm obviously not gonna shoot him. Calm him down with bullets, three rick? No. You think the blue option? These aren't your people? Ugh! Son of a bitch! We can work this out. We can work this out. Rex, we can work this out. We can work this out. <sighs> These Krogan are slaves of Saren. Puppets, tools to be used and discarded. Is that what you want for your people? Sarah will be as generous. All right, Shepard. You've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. Yeah. Ha. Oh. Salt and Saren's face when you're ready. Oh my god. That was so stressful. Greetings, human. I am Commander Rentola. I can provide you with supplies for the upcoming mission. For anything else, I suggest you speak with Captain Kirahi. Let me see what you have. What little there is. I think I, hold on, I picked up some, uh, I picked up some, some better stuff. Maybe. Did I? Oh, by heart. Can't believe, can't believe we almost shot Rex. Well, we weren't going to shoot him, but. He got so mad at me. Hi, Evelyn. How's it going? All right, guys, we're gonna we're gonna save here. We're gonna save here because it's been about four hours, and my heart is uh, <laughs> my heart needs a bit of a rest. And then um, we'll pick up here on Thursday. Cause I, I feel like if I if I talk to talk to this guy, it's gonna start like a like a long mission. Some time to come down from that battle. That was intense. What the hell? <laughs> that was so intense. Oh man. Let's get um let's get comfy and think about what we did. Everybody is still alive. Everything is good. Nobody died. Right? So that's a thing. Except that one guy. <laughs> yeah, nobody, nobody died except for that one guy. Um, but guys, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. These streams are super comfy. So thanks for, thanks for being here and chatting and lurking. 